Connecticut Governor of Maine addressed the state's heroin epidemic on Wednesday. He's in hot water for his characterization of who he says is dealing the drugs in this nearly all-white state. These are people that take drugs. These are guys of the name D-Money, Smoothie, Shifty, uh, these type of guys that come from Connecticut, New York. They come up here, they sell their heroin, then they go back home. Incidentally, half the time they impregnate a young white girl before they leave, which is a real sad thing. Money. Doing that. <laughs> freestyle. When white folks freestyle, you see how a section called when white folks freestyle. Because, <laughs> <'cause>, man. Right. <laughs> ooh, it's a bad thing when they impregnate these white girls. Was that on the teleprompter, sir? <laughs> what are you saying? I'm just saying. I'm just saying. Hey. I mean, deal, just deal with the fact that you got some white folks in your state with heroin problems. And, and I, and, well, here's what's still getting me. Okay, I'm looking at all these people who were just trashing crack mothers and black folks taking crack in the 80s, 90s, 2000s, present day. But all of a sudden, now we got white kids dropping left and right in New Hampshire and Maine and Vermont because of heroin. When now it's, we should really be good. We need to help these people they have an addiction, which is true, right? Very true. But it, the the frightening thing is that this, you know, sort of you hear it, it wasn't on a teleprompter. Right? Like this was this. this but he yeah, says yeah, some yeah, other, first of all, he crazy. Yeah, he, he says, says some other, other stuff. I yeah. mean, yeah. right? Andrew don't even want to own him as a Republican. Yeah. He don't even want at all. So that's just the real. Thing. Andrew's real lonely these days. Uh -oh. I, hey, I'm not that lonely. I mean. <laughs> Trump, these crazy folks. Oh my goodness! I mean, Sorry, I don't speak for the